two halves really for Bengaluru. They lost eight out of ten leading up to Christmas. It's a dramatic turnaround, maybe only comparable with what Chennai in did in the 2019-20 season. Yeah, and that was Owen Coyle that did that, another British manager, of course. You turn around, it's Simon Grayson here that's got this side playing the way that they have been as well. well they did go on to beat Goa 2-0 in that match following, but then a few more defeats suffered before they settled back into their rhythm. Noah Poyer tonight. <laughs> Bengaluru in the dark blue will get us underway, kicking from left to right in the first half. Presented with that 100 shirt by his coach, Des Buckingham, before the game. Going for the return, Jovanovic tried to guide that back penalty. across. Pereira penalty. Diaz goes down, penalty given. No one has tracked Bippin in. Jovanovic doesn't get the contact. There you see Pereira Diaz gets to the ball. And Gerbreit, that's silly. Four penalties, four scored for Stewart. Had to wait a long time, here he comes. Saved by Gerbreit. And the second one as well, blocked away from Chante's re reply. But look at how that hand goes out from Gerbreit. What a moment at this time. You know, I'm not sure many goalkeepers would have got across to that. We said he's the biggest goalkeeper in the league, and that was going right in the corner from Stewart. Wonderful save. And he got one foot on the line as well. Brilliant save. <laughs> by Krishna Shivasakti. Meta tracking across. Nicely done. Great ball in, Hanny Hernandez! Bengaluru score a massive goal against the run of play. Made by Shivasakti, scored by Hanny Hernandez. They lead 1-0, the aggregates 2. Are they heading for the final? Great moment, big moment. Our BFC to series side on. Brilliant piece of skill. Where, oh where is the marking? But this young man, Shivasakti, Never mind announcing himself on the ISL stage. Comes up front in the second leg of the semi-final. Puts it on a plate for Javi Hernandez, who says thank you very much. What a finish from Javi, and celebration to boot. Well, Becky. Pereira Diaz takes on the chest, Borges! Brilliant save, and put in by Pippin. And Mumbai City are back in this one. Roland Borges denied by Gerpri. But the man who celebrated his birthday in midweek, making a 100th Mumbai appearance, gets the goal. Ball just whipped in. How about that touch there from Pereira Diaz? Jingen gets caught out and just goes walk about, doesn't deal with the situation. No one picks up Roland. What a save again from the big man Gerpri in goal. But Prabhia Das doesn't react quickly enough, just turns around. And it's only because it's dropped right to Bippin that he can slot that one in. In terms of passing at the moment, Stewart. Big Nash. To catch out, Gerbrit comes back off the bar. But he looked like he was going for the cross. Gerbrit had to backtrack, it came square off the face, no one following up. There's this attempt again. Chanty's just gone in there and gambled, hasn't he? Big Nesh is trying to whip it to that far post area and Javi's up with him, plays it, Javi Hernandez, it's Hernandez in a goal! Saved by Perbola Ciampa. The whole game changes. Again, a wonderful ball from Siba. It's just the first touch from Javi, takes him a little bit wider than he would have liked and that angle then goes against him. Beke just throws himself at it. The Chempa just crouches down. But we're approaching the, the final minute of the six. Stewart, oh, allowed it to bounce and allows the ball to run out of play. And more frustrations for Mumbai. As the referee brings us to a close. A fascinating first half. Javi Hernandez scored the opening goal. Gerbrey made that wonderful save from Greg Stewart's penalty. Bippin did get a goal, his seventh of the season, to level things up. They're going to put pressure on. It's going to be a fascinating clash. Paul Macefield has made it back up from pitch side. And, uh, well, penny for the thoughts of both Buckingham and Simon Grayson. Yep, patience, order of the day for Des Buckingham. He'll tell his side to be patient. Stop making silly mistakes defensively. Don't allow them to get their noses in front again. Uh, and BFC, I'm sure Simon Grayson is saying, I want 45 minutes of exactly the same, boys. Beat to the ball, a lovely turn away by Greg Stewart as well. Nice reverse ball into Pippin. Angle was tight, turn well. Gerpreet had his angles right though. Good save by the Bengaluru goalkeeper. 
There's Matata far with the header. Krishna. There it is again, Bippin with a touch on the turn. Krishna up with him. Javi Hernandez is in a little bit of space. Nicks it away from Ahmed Jahu. Javi Hernandez is in on goal again. It's Javi! Brilliant save by Pamela Ciampa. Big strong hand. And what a moment that would have been for Javi to get his second of the match. But again, Siva Sakti just takes out Jahu like he's not there. And then just plays it in front. Good pass appreciation. Javi hits the target. Look, Chep has gone past it and has reacted brilliantly to stop this going across his body. You can see all the weight on his left hand side. That's a big, big save. Find a space, find a hole, create something. Pereira Diaz getting across quick. Stewart plays out wide. Looking for Bippy. Gerprit at full stretch, it was almost in slow motion there, Gerprit from Pippin's header, and it's another wonderful save, it was almost like something out of the Matrix, it was like he froze in mid-air there, Gerprit, what a save this is, that's a foul, Pippin with a little nudge. He's looking a little bit tired at the moment, having given everything, in comes the corner from Stewart, this time! It's Metab who gets the goal, and Mumbai have leveled it up on aggregate, they lead in the tie for the first time, Stewart just fires it in. Zonal marking. No one marking Metab at the back. Bruno Ramirez gets caught ball watching. But take nothing away from that header. Metab Singh with what is the biggest goal of his career. And what a moment to score it as well. And just listen as these BFC fans try to get behind their side and lift them. Here's Rochat. Into Javi once again on the turn! Wonderful save by the Ciampa. Fingertips from the goalkeeper. That was heading for the bottom corner on the turn. What is going on with the goalkeepers tonight? They are in absolute scintillating form. What a save! Those roars are for this. And he comes. Suresh. Rohit Kumar. Krishna on the charge, here goes Krishna, Metab got there first, does he? Krishna still has possession, Krishna! Too high from Roy Krishna. Lovely ball by Rohit Kumar to put it through, and he's got no right to win that. Metab has to deal with that ball first, but Krishna just moves the ball out from under his feet, just goes and lashes at it a little bit too much. Jinga. There goes the full-time whistle. We're in for another 30 minutes between these two. Javi Hernandez got the opening goal to put Bengaluru in front and turn them into a 2-0 aggregate lead. Bipin got a goal back before Meta popped up to make it 2-1 to Mumbai on the night. It is a first defeat in 11 games for Bengaluru. Gurpreet made a penalty save from Greg Stewart in that first half. Lechempa made important saves as well. It's been a real blood and thunder knockout match. So it will be Bengaluru back the way we were in the first half, kicking from left to right. Stewart. Vikram's continued his run. Pereira Diaz in the middle! Right across the face of goal. How has he not got the touch to send that into the net? And Pereira Diaz, four yards out, puts it in the back of the net. Left foot, he's only got to open himself up and put the left foot there, and it goes flying past Gerprit. It's a great opening here for Bengaluru. Pablo Perez floats one in again. Krishna! Wonderful save! Mortana Fahl puts it against his own post. Back out to Rohit Kumar! Here's oh. the one from Krishna. How's that save again? But Mortana Fahl has just tried to clear his lines. Doesn't know what's behind him. But he's just rattled the woodwork. His header, first touch from Mandar, gives the ball straight to Roshan. There's half time in extra time as the ball was played up towards Pablo Perez. No time for Mumbai to get the ball for uh, for uh, Bengaluru to get the ball forward here. See which way this tie is going to go. It's Mumbai that will get us underway for the second period of added time. To Mumbai, this is the side they scored the goal for Metab, it's taken short to Vikram, Bengaluru need to stay switched on here, it's back in again by Stuart, Pereira Diaz again. What a chance, what a chance. Perez skips away from Jahu, pursued by Vikram, Chetri plays it back, Perez! No 
power in the side foot straight at the Chetri just flicks it through. Back in by Javi towards Dingana, and Costa! Just wide of the post, scored two late-headed winners against North East United, and he wasn't far there, I think the Chempa's got a touch on that. Got in save. Brilliant. Costa looks for that far corner, and that is just fingertips. We'll see from this angle if it was going in or not. Was it creeping in? Was it creeping in? It possibly was going to hit the ball. Down the line looking for Chante, Pramir Das. Like an express train getting across, but the ball beats him into touch. <laughs> an express train. <laughs> and there's the final whistle. Wow. The keepers have been superb. It's finished uh, after extra time, by the way. Bengaluru 1, Mumbai City FC 2. 2-2 two, two on aggregate. No away goals, so it would be a penalty shootout now. Oh, they're going to get fed up with shaking hands with each other, these, these <laughs> aren't they? That's a third time tonight. So five penalties each to come. Who will hold their nerve? Who will draw first blood? Who is going to the final in Goa? The next 20 minutes or so will tell us. Against Gurpri. First penalty in the shootout. Went the other way, Gurpri guessed right. Dived over the top of it, Mumbai lead 1-0. Perba Lachempa, who has the nerve. Javi Hernandez, well taken, penalty, 1-1. One, one. There is Pereira Diaz, hesitated, Kirby got a hand to it, but can only help it into the net. So, so close to the first save in the shootout. High again, same side as Hernandez, another well taken penalty, it's 2-2 in the shootout. It's 2-2. Sends him the wrong way. First time we've seen the keeper go the wrong way. Here comes Costa. The Chempa waits. High into the roof of the net. Smashed it into the top corner. Against Gerbery. 3 3. After three kicks each in the shootout. Here comes Ahmed Jahu. Into the corner as well. Sends the keeper the wrong way. Well taken against La Chempa. not much of a run-up here. Oh, squeezed in, La Chempa gets right, and Orlo's got a hand on it. Last of the five, sudden death it is now anyway. Here comes Raul Becke! Power, just enough to beat Gerpreet, and it was the power that took it in. Here is Perez, against La Chempa, straight down the middle. 5-5, five, five. more penalties needed. Here he comes, Cooley done again, sends the keeper the wrong way. Up against Perbat Lachempa, sends the keeper the wrong way again. It's another brilliantly taken penalty. It's six all, 100% so far. It's out of foul, up against Gerbry. Lazy looking run up, and again the goalkeeper gets wrong and goes the wrong way. My <laughs> games. I love that. Here he comes, Rohit. And again, the goalkeeper goes the wrong way. Another brilliantly taken penalty. This is real quality from these two teams. Nervous as everybody else. Here's Vinic Rai then against Gerpreet. Sends him the wrong way again. Against Perba Lachempa. And again goes the wrong way. Penalties so far. All 16 have been scored. Here comes Meta against Gerpreet. Shootout! It's the man whose goal gave Mumbai the win, but he's the full guy at the moment. And it gives him, would you believe, Sandis Jingan the chance to come forward and put Bengaluru into the final. For BFC to go through to the hero ISL final. What a moment for Sandis Jingan, a man who's never scored in the hero ISL, but he scores in the shootout. And BFC are in the final. Reclaim the crowns, here's the banner away to the left. Are they about to reclaim that crown? They're 90 minutes away from a final win once again. Drama at the Sri Kanta Riva, and the hero is Sandes Jinga. <laughs> unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. What a magical game of football, what a magical night at the Sri Kanta Riva. A penalty shootout that goes to 9-8. And BFC, after what had happened in their opening 10 games, finally...
find themselves on the cusp of being crowned champions of the Hero ISL. Unbelievable. You couldn't write the script.